Hey everyone, Boston Hayes here um, with a review on the Olight PL Mini Valkyrie 2. Um, one thing I want to tell you is uh, if you like these videos and um, I'm really trying to grow my channel so I could really uh, appreciate the support if you could hit the like button, uh, maybe share the video, tell your friend, um, have them like and subscribe if you haven't already subscribed. Um, I'll be coming up with a lot of I think pretty cool videos in the future um, of some of the firearms that I own. Um, so uh, with that being said, I'll get right to the um, review. My review again is on the Olight PL Mini Valkyrie 2. Um, it's a light by Olight. Uh, one of the best things I like about it, and I can tell you is when I first got it, I was a little worried uh, about the clamp system here. When you feel it, it, it's made out of aluminum of some sort, but it just didn't feel all that solid. But I can tell you, um, day in and day out, every night, this thing comes on and off in the morning. And it, I've had it for three years and I've taken it on and off. So for two times, so 700 times a year, this thing has come on and off. And, and more than that, actually, because uh, uh, my son uses it. It actually fits one of his toy guns. Um, so I've let him play with it when he was younger. And uh, also, um, I've used it in demonstrations on a, on a plastic gun, a uh, demonstration gun. So anyways, uh, this has this will fit all types of guns as long as you have a rail system compatible. Uh, in case you're wondering, I've used it, um, tried it with the Glock 19. This is an MP um, 40C. Um, Smith & Wesson M&P 40C, the compact version. Um, also, my wife has a, a Canik TB9 SC Elite. It fits that one perfect also. Um, one of the great things about it is uh, no matter what the length of your barrel, you can adjust it. So for me, you know, obviously it's a short compact barrel. I have it all the way in. But if you had a longer barrel, you could, or if you just liked it out that far, I guess you have long, long fingers, you could put it out that far. But uh, for me, I like it all the way in there like that, okay? Um, some of the features about this light, um, first of all, is the durability of this latch system. This latch system, I, I can tell you, definitely has been tried, um, and it works perfect. No play, uh, it's not sloppy at all. I've used it at the range too, so um, as far as being durable after being fired, I can attest to that. Um, I also pay for all my uh, products that I'm testing out. Um, I've had no contributions to PayPal, and uh, no sponsorship. So obviously I, I, I purchase and everything that uh, I'm reviewing guys is gonna be the honest truth. Um, nobody's in my pockets. Um, and even if that was the case, I'd still give an honest review, but uh, that's not the case. So um, it has a 600 lumen uh, output. So it's, it's a pretty bright little light. Um, I really like it. Here's a little close up of it, okay. Uh, again, I want to show you guys, I'm the only one here right now, but my guns for all these reviews are clear, nothing in the chamber, nothing, no magazine, so this gun is safe. Um, but anyways, it has 600 lumen beam, distance, distance of about 100 meters, so you know, uh, it has a pretty good distance on it, um, you know, for the little light that it is. Um, like I said, it has a proven quick release switch here, okay. Um, also, I want to show you uh, how the light system works. If you want a quick on and off, if you're just kind of want to check out an area, you press, hold down, release. Press, hold down, release. Okay, now if you want it to stay on, you just hit it on. Okay, um, it's at a convenient location. Okay, I don't see any uh, slippage of the, onto the trigger with this. Um, it was a kind of a concern. As you can see, you know, you're right in that area and that's always a scary place to be unless you're gonna pull that trigger. But, um, like I said, it, 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 it works great. I mean, if you want it on and off, you know, it's just um, a convenient and tough little light. Um, uh, so anyways, um, I just wanted to show you this. The charging system is also really good. Um, it's a simple magnetic there, slap that on, plug it in. Uh, like I said, this thing comes off super easy. Thing, you know, you just 
charge it just like that. Uh, it's a red light when you start losing your charge. Um, red light shows up. Oh, here it is right here. There's a little spot here for the red light um, when it's low. And it will turn green when fully charged. Um, so anyways, uh, I'm going to pause the video and then I want to take this outside and show you um, what it looks like in the dark and uh, you know the range. My fence from where I'll be standing is roughly about 100, 120 feet. So um, you'll be able to see that uh, in the video here. Okay, so just bear with me and we'll be outside when we restart. Okay, everyone, uh, this is Boston Hayes here. Um, oh, and we have EAA going on in the background. I don't know if you can see up in the sky, but there is a plane with uh, some bright lights going on. But <laughs> what I wanted to show you is um, directly in front of me, there's a sign that says for campers only. Um, th that distance from here is roughly um, 100 feet from where I'm standing with this camera. And I'm going to light it up for you so you can see exactly how strong this light is. Okay, if you can see directly ahead, there's a sign on my fence that says campers only. That is about 110 feet. Okay, um, beyond that, some pine trees. Okay, those are probably 120 feet away, 125 feet. Um, this gun has, or the gun, the light, has a really good range. I'm going to go diagonal across my yard. Okay, I'm going to be out of range vocally, um, but I'm going to stand diagonal, and that's about 300 feet from corner to corner. And um, hopefully here I'll have the camera angled right, and uh, you will be able to see what I'm talking about. Okay, um, I'm not going to, you're probably not going to be able to hear me, but I'm going to walk back to the corner. It's going to take me a few seconds, and... Um, I'm going to light it up across, and that's going to be about 300 feet to the corner of the fence. All right, everyone, I uh, hope you could see that. That was about 300 feet. Um, just wanted to show you the light. It is extremely bright, okay? Um, and like I said, it's the, the switch pressed down and it's right there, so it's a perfect location. Um, I really like it. Not sure if you're seeing that all that well, but uh, again, this was out here just to show you the effectiveness of the range. And um, we're going to pause it and uh, go back inside, and I'm going to wrap this video up. Okay, guys, I'm back again um, and to wrap up this video. Uh, what I wanted to say is I paid about 80 bucks for this, and you can find them, I think, anywhere from 75 bucks to 110 bucks online. Um, is it worth it for what I paid every penny? Um, like I said, this thing has always, never once not worked. Uh, charges really quickly. The charge lasts, I can't give you a specific time, but I can tell you that I have only had to charge it a few times um, per year. And that's with me uh, playing around like this every once in a while with it. Um, but like I said, I've taken it to the range, I've fired it. Um, nothing is damaged, nothing, was dislodged it works great um, definitely worth every penny I would definitely recommend it um, for your gun um, it's perfect for compact guns like I said uh, with the setting all the way in like this I mean it's it's not moving it's stable as hell um, the way it operates is just really simple and and, and works every time um, I don't know I, I definitely would recommend this uh, like I said you can get it for 80 bucks um, and also again, if you please, if you haven't liked or subscribed, could you do so? Um, liking it also uh, gets my video boosted um, and you know, it gets pushed in different platforms. Um, and it's really hard for me to get mine pushed um, and get subscribers since it is, uh, 
I actually have fire rims on my videos and um, I'll be having some where I'm actually shooting them and their YouTube really frowns upon that. So um, with that being said, as far as uh, for home defense um, situation, nighttime, this light is perfect. It uh, really works well. Um, you're definitely gonna see uh, what you're gonna be shooting at and that's one of the most important things at nighttime when you're shooting is to be able to see what you're shooting at. And um, you will be able to with this light uh, every single time. Okay, so um, that's it. This is Boston Patriot wrapping it up. Um, if you stuck around this long, thank you very much. Um, and uh, you know, like I said, please like and subscribe. Um, be safe. And uh, well, God bless America. Thanks.